Also, guys, another SBC. We've got Stephen Kulker coming in price-wise around about 80k for this one. Another busy day. Zhao Kin and the Liga 85 Plus are already out on the channel. Go check them out if you need them. Prime or Moments Icon as well will be out tonight. So subscribe, you don't want to miss that. So this Korka card, it is obviously a Turkish League. That's now the new second team of the season behind the La Liga currently. So uh, hopefully you, you pack one or two of those. Um, anyway, medium high work rates on the centre back card. Two star, two star. Pace... Not the best split. I'd like to see the acceleration higher indeed. Um, shooting obviously isn't important on him. Passing, short pass, long pass, curve are all very good. So the short pass, long pass, uh, definitely very good for a centre-back. Brilliant agility on the centre-back card. Balance is decent as well. It's not bad at all. Reactions, ball control, composure as well. I don't know how important the composure is for a centre-back, to be honest. But that's incredible. Um, Defending-wise, very good. Very good base. Again, you probably want to boost it up with a Ken style. But it is a very good... There's nothing glaringly, obviously, like bad, which is often key for these sorts of cards. And then very good physicals as well. Top-tier strength, good stamina jumping for a centre-back, and decent aggression on him as well. Power header. Obviously, the league-wise, not the easiest to link, but being English, there's definitely options. And I think this is a very good centre-back. If you're someone that doesn't use full-backs as centre-backs, like a lot of people seem to be doing in the weekend league, if you actually use center backs maybe it's the card for you anyway let's jump in to the solution we have two teams we have the first one coming in around 20k it's a nice 80 rated you need an english player easiest way is to just build a premier league team which you end up with loads of english players so uh, yeah no worries there team of the week wise Bialski is in this week's current team of the week. Any 80 rated would do though, so if you've got another 80 rated in form, stick them in. And then a random 80 here, Akin Fief being one of the cheapest, any 80 rated would do. I'm sure you've got somebody 80 rated in the club you can stick in. So yeah, let's run through all the player names. We've got Matt Ryan, um, Bialski Balals or any 80 rated in form. Tarkovsky, uh, Evans, Davies, Hoiberg, Akinfeev, Milner, Declan Rice, Harvey Barnes, and Ings. So there you go, that is it. National duty done. Second one, top form. This one's coming in around 60k. You need an inform, any 83 rated inform would do. Bongonda from this current team of the week is basically discard. So uh, any 83 rated inform would do though. Um, the core to the team is a Serie A one, but we've also got another flexible in, in terms of Galashi. Any 85 would do. So Marquinhos, Depay, I think, are looking relatively cheap for 85s at the minute. So any 85 would work if you've got one perfect to come in and down there. Maybe if you got unlucky from the 85 plus um, Liga pick, you could put some fodder in there. So let's go through all the player names. We have Paul Lopez, Bongonda, or any 83 rated in form. De Vries, Skrinia, Goulashi, Lukasieva, Ramsey, Arthur, or Arthur, Jose Callahan, Jeco, and Gusen. So there you go, guys, that is it. That is top form done. And that is Stephen Corker done. So let me know if you're going to be picking this card up. I'll be interested to see if people actually manage to get him into your team. So let me know in the comments down below. Smash the thumbs up button if this has helped. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the Primal Moments icon in a bit. See you soon. Peace.